we're down at Tennyson Beach today. We're going to be, well, Matilda's going to be having a bit of a swim. Yeah. And I'm going to try some um, flicking some soft plastics and lures with the uh, tea care, see if we can maybe get a flatty or maybe some salmon or something like That'd that. That'd be good. All right, let's give it a crack. Yeah. So Matilda's chosen the Streak 3.75 in the Nuke Chicken, so that's that probably going to be more for, shells. and she's found some she's pretty shells. Found some pretty shells as well. Uh, so that's probably going to be more for our flatties, I guess. We'll put that on a. Um, uh, we don't know because we don't want to take them home, darling. Oh, okay. Leave them for nature. Yeah, for mother nature. I was just looking through here. That's that's what I was planning on. Putting it on the one quarter two O T T. And I'm gonna apologize. I've completely broken my wireless remote. So apologies for the sound if it's not great. I'm gonna have to get it fixed. Um, fishing last night uh, out at Wallaroo Jetty and the tripod did the old blow over with the wind and smashed the front screen of the receiver. That was bad? Yeah, that was really bad. Like very bad? And gonna be really expensive to fix, but anyway. So wind's going left to right. Tide's coming in. Yes, it's recording. Hi. There you go, that's rigged pretty well on the TT Demons UV jig head. You got some sand. You're making a sand castle. And I've just got to get some S factor. So these streaks have a big cavity underneath. Yeah, and see it's got a little hole in the top. That's because a bird, I believe, pecked through it. Leave that out in anticipation of catching a fish. Yeah. So I like to load these up in these belly cavities. Having fun? Is the tide coming in, sir? It is coming in, yeah. I might actually take my shoes off and get in the water. I think you're right. Yeah, and your socks. Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna take my stuff off. Okay. Let's go do that. Put my phone in your bag too. Okay. I've got sunscreen on. That's good. Yeah, it's okay. It's nice. Water's, no. water's nice. Big waves? Yeah, very big. Yeah. Do you want to try and wind it in just a little bit? Yeah, sure. We're just slowly, slowly. Like that. What are you trying to fish for? So we might get some flathead. What about some squid? Well, we won't catch squid on that. But you can wind it in, keep winding. Is that a bit better? Yeah. A bit more constant. A bit yeah. more constant. Have you felt anything? No. You'll feel it. When? Did I keep my finger in the line? Sorry? No, no, because you're winding. Yeah, how do I know? You'll feel it. I can tug, I don't see it. Yeah, you'll see it. Go, tug, tug, tug. So we have got a few little bites on that um, 3.75 streaks. Um, I think they're just smaller salmon. Now the water's getting a bit warmer. Yeah, the water gets... Yeah, the water gets warmer as it comes in too. So, we're going to try and put a smaller, might put the X wrap on. And if we have to go smaller, we'll go smaller. Yes. What bag are you getting? You're getting that bag so you can replace it with another one? Yeah, so I'm going to just put this in the bag. So I always put my soft plastics away. We're going to use a lure? What lure are you going to use? Are you going to use one of your new ones? Yeah. All right, so I'm going to try the X wrap. Can people see that? Oh, it's nice. Okay. Nice. So that's what we got those last lot of salmon on in that last video. Good and job. If they are salmon, if they are salmon out there, then this should help. So apologies if the camera work isn't up that to good. But anyway, I'll go put it on my head and we'll go out. We'll go out and we'll um, try to catch some more fish. This is a shell that my dad found. You might not be able to see it that well, but it's very shiny. Yeah. Very shiny. 
So we just first cast to the X-Rap. Ooh, exciting! I need you to hold that out of the water. It was wrapped around the top, so it's untangled. Huh? Sure. Fishing is meant to be relaxing. Oh, damn it. Did I just lose a lure? I got it. Oh, don't, okay, I'll get it. Can you grab the line? Here's the line. Got it? Yeah. Okay. I've got it, thanks. And hop, and one, two, three, four, hop, be hop. And a big, 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 and not long enough. Oh, see the fish chasing it? There was definitely fish chasing it. Watch, watch, watch. All right, just come here and be really quiet. Not sure if they're mullet or whiting. Oh, they weren't following at that time. But there was definitely fish they're following at. Yeah, there's fish there too. Big wave. Wow, so we've had a couple of follows. I'm not sure if they're mullet or if they're whiting. Um, I'm gonna try and put another soft plastic on. I'm just gonna put a curly tail on, see if that gets them interested. And we'll see how we go. So that's the split tail grub. And I've just put the um, 112 UV painted jig head on that. Matilda's asking about what that is. It looks like a shell to me. It has a bump. Has bumps on it? Yeah. And we'll give that a flick after we put some S factor on it and that should hopefully attract these smaller fish. Let's go deeper. Yeah, I don't want to go too deep because the waves can come in. It'll like because <coughs> the tide the tide oh, yeah. the tide's coming in at the same time. It's so warm on the way. It is they're warm. <laughs> sure. No. Can I walk on the new one? Yeah. Oh, wait, is that a bite? Where? That's not, it's just a piece of seaweed. Look, look at the fish, uh, can you see the fish around it there? At where my, did you see them? I don't know what they are. I don't, I think, I think they're mullet. They're definitely interested. <laughs> it's good to see that there's fish around. But it'll be good to get one and catch one. Yeah, there's plenty of little ones chasing it. Okay. Like I'm so little bit. Like I'm so little bit though. Big wave coming, Dada. Thank you. Oh, 
eat. That one took it. <laughs> just as I was about to pull it out of the water. Hey, look, look. Watch the end of my rod. Look. And look at the soft plastic. Oh my lord! Alright. So they, they are biting. But they just don't like it apparently. The only other one I could think of is to get out the 1.75 micro finesse shad. And do you want to do that? Mm, I'll see how we go here. We might, I mean, really, I want a bigger one to come along. <laughs> here are high. So what we really want is one of those baby mum or dads to come along. Yeah, that'll be a dinner for you two. Not for me. Because you don't eat fish. As if, yes. Oh, they're following it right up and then just backing off of it. I don't know what we got to do. I think they see us. They might see us too, but. Also camouflage into dark colours, Dad. Possibly. Might just Whee! flick it rather than slow roll, see if that... You flick it when you get the retention. Because yes. with the Z-Man plastic, the, the tail will flick up in the air. Oh, yes, there was something on that. I wonder what it could be. Yeah, I've got one chilled, I think. What did you get? I've got one. Not very big, but we got one. So what are they? Oh, they are a little salmon. Can I feel it? Yeah, hang on, I've got to get him off first. It's bleeding. Yeah. Oh, little fishy. Actually, I don't want to touch it with the blood. I'm just, hang on, I've got to get some line out here. Can you just hold that for me? Don't get it in the water. Pliers. I always forget that I've got them. I'm like, what can I use? But you have pliers. You have pliers, Dad. Sorry, dude. Oh, it's he. It's for your own good. There we go. I think. Yeah. Uh, I don't what's know. Her name? What's her name? I don't think he's gonna make it, but what he's do you gonna. Mean? I want her. I want it with you. No, thank you. Yeah. What's her name be? Oh, he's sort of making it. He'll be someone's dinner. I want it to be a girl. But too small. Well, Blood. You're bleeding, Dad. I'm not bleeding. It's the fish. <laughs> Watch out, big wave. <laughs> right, so should we try and do that again? No, no, try and catch it. Oh, that fish didn't make it. It's floating. Oh, fish. Oh, fish. Well, he just took that way. We can't keep him because he's under size. He's a sheep. Okay. My name is Precious. Precious. We just have to let nature do its thing. So, rather than that slow rolling. You're going to flip past? You're going to flip? No, no, no. I, I was just doing little flicks. And then that just lifts that up off of the floor. You can go get that fish and feed it to the seagull. No. All right, let's see if we can get another one too. And we're just going to let it sink. So guys, let me know in the comments if we're going to need to do more videos with Matilda. <laughs> do you think you'd like that? Would you no, like to? I want to be famous with you. We're not famous. Please like and subscribe. We're never going to be famous, but. We might. Well, we caught that fish and haven't had a bite since so hmm, not sure bit of fun though good way to spend the afternoon without it being too serious just wanted to spend some time with Matilda and um, yeah didn't want to have to travel too far so just came down to Adelaide and packed light with the soft plastics and lures and yeah there's a few salmon trout around but uh, be nice to get a flatty or something like that and I guess possibly as the tide comes in and we get further up those banks that'll pretty much almost create a bit of a gutter here uh, which hopefully the floodies are going to want to come up on this tide's coming in pretty quick hey, yeah i'm just going to fish out there you can go in there there's fish there tiny ones there's tiny fish following See, look, those fish are right there too, at the end of my rod. Need their mamas and puppers. Yeah, so we're just um, moving our stuff again because this tide's coming in. As I said, I hadn't fished here before, but you can see the, the water coming in and that channel. We're getting a bit movement, 
and stuff? How long do you want to stay? But when, when that joins up with this, yeah. what you'd want to do is like cast onto this bank and then bring it into this water. And that's where you're going to get a floody. If there's any around, you might actually just go out. See how that's, see how that's yellow out there? And then this is greener. So it means, it means there's more sand up there. So then we can stand on that sand a bit further out and big wave another big one okay we haven't got much battery left guys and i didn't bring the spare one out with me so we've just uh, come out into a sand spit and we're going to cast straight out and we'll come back if there's any uh, action because yeah we're literally in the red 